Oh, it is a sore. We're gonna run straight from the gym today. Oh, my flipping legs. So we did three miles the first day, four miles yesterday, and we're trying to run 10 miles. I'm not exactly sure where this path goes, so we're gonna find out. Damn it, I need to pee. Like the outsides of my quads are just pain. Ooh, what's down here? Any pilgrims down here? Can I have some privacy, please? There's a little yeah, stone path to get across the stream. So get in down there and then walk across. Check that out on the way back. Very nice. <laughs> it's a bit bloody chilly this morning. My goal when I get to a good spot to, of running is to find some really, or like start visiting cool places to run and just explore instead of just running around neighborhoods. <laughs> Cause that's not very exciting. I normally try and have a plan for each day, but I haven't really planned anything out yet. I got lots of new stuff in yesterday, which are all ideas for videos, things I want to try. So I'll plan out one of those when I get back, choose which one I want to do. Whoops. Looks nice down there. This is something I love about running, is that it's like a faster way just to see different places. Wow, it's just picturesque, you know? Gorgeous. Someone's sock. Okay, Oliver. Oh, another video idea I have. I'd like to attach a light and a camera to an RC car and then go into one of those storm drains and just see if there's anything. Find a nice hillbilly family or something. Oh shit, there's a deer. It's literally a deer. Hello, bud. What's your name? That's so cool to see. Oh, there's another. I don't know if you can see it up there. He's licking his backside. You and me both, brother. Might be a female. Hi. Morning. See, the wildlife here in the suburbs of Kansas City, just a spectacle. Oh, I, 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 oh have been called the songbird of my generation multiple times by the deaf community. Not quite as picturesque this way. All right, this path just stops up here. So I guess we're gonna head back this way, down another path. Oh, I do know what my plan is for today. I'm gonna make some rosemary hair oil. So after this, we'll go and get the stuff. I have a vague idea of what I need to do, but enough to be dangerous. Run 15 and a half miles today. That's a live tracker. Go down here. Is that a path? Kansas, you never cease to amaze me. Shopping trolley over there, pill bottle down there. Let's go and see what it is. Free drugs. Let's hope I can get back up here. Oh shit, almost fell in. Where's my way across? Oh, frog. All right, I think that one, straight across. If not, I'm getting a wet foot. We did it. What drugs we got going on here? Ah, some brain health drugs. Nasty, I'm gonna take that one to the trash. It wasn't my intention, but here we are. We're gonna go this one and then just try and jump it. And then that one. Oh, slippery. That one. Okay, oh, we did it. Where's the bin? This is the spot. Oh, toothpicks, lovely. Why do I feel like this has been built? Come on then. What is that? Oh, it's quite warm. Oh, is it a vape? Oh gosh. No, I've touched it, I have to pick it up. Well, I'm not gonna go over there. Let's head home. Oh shoot. Ew, splashed up my leg. I'm trying to see one of those Burmese pythons. Definitely hanging around this area. 
We up, King. I don't know why I say these things. It just comes out and I don't really... Is that a Ravens jersey? Oh my gosh, it is a Ravens. What are you doing, Oliver? Why are you doing this, son? Here's our treasure for today. Honestly, I found more on this run than when I actually went magnet fishing. Ew! I see some dumpsters up there. Zoom. I've missed. I've bloody missed. Let's go wipe my hand off. Ew. Okay, let's go to Walmart, get some bits. I think that run was only like two miles, but I'll have the ring tracker thing. I think it arrives today, so we'll use that tomorrow if it's here. But I had fun, it was a good time. Actually, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Got some wipes in, some baby wipes in the car. A couple of other bits stuck in there. That's from the video I did on Friday. Went to a pickup game, Sporting KC set up a pickup game, and I was there to film a video on behalf of the MLS. I had no idea what to expect, so I just brought a load of stuff. Ended up being a really good time. I had a lot of people turn out. All right, Walmart. I've gone no poo for over 300 days and my scalp's really dry and itchy. So we're gonna get some stuff to make rosemary oil. DIY rosemary oil. Big up Wally D's, Wally M's. Okay, we're in the fresh produce, looking for some rosemary. Also, I put a note in my phone of what I needed, and I put down parsley. <laughs> That'll do. It's like two ingredients I needed, and I've forgotten one of them. Cloves, that's it. I bought this, like, diffuser thing. It's not a diffuser, is it? But you put the oils in it, and then it, you can rub it through your hair, and it's meant to, like, drip the oils in the right places on your scalp. That, I think that arrives today. So if I get this ready, we can do this tomorrow. Whole cloves. Bloody hell, those are expensive. Six dollars for whole cloves. You having a laugh, sunshine? Where's the flipping great value ones? Oh, my flipping thighs, dude. Got cinnamon sticks. Oh, no, they don't have any. Here we go. Organic. Okay, the video I saw the girls was using, like, tons of different oils. I'm just going to use avocado oil that we have at home. Oh, and I need distilled water. Also, I can't understand why you Americans like goldfish. They are possibly the worst cracker you can possibly get. Honestly, I hate Cheez-Its. Cheez-Its are better than that. Cheez-It grooves though, on the other hand. Oh, but get me some chicken in a biscuit. That opened up a whole new world for me. This guy's always here. Oh, I guess so am I. No worries, not at all. I'll uh, quickly get out your way. Thanks. Sorry, thank you, sir. I remember when these used to be 124. Like, gosh, maybe that was two years ago now? Let's go home. Wife's just gotten back from uh, taking the boys out for a walk. One of them's going mental. <laughs> okay, one cup of avocado oil. I do, da. I do, da. He's alright for the moment, thanks. Actually, if you wouldn't mind, I need two hands. What would you just do? Hi, Covey. You want to get some hungies? Uh -huh. While that finishes boiling, let's wash the rosemary. Oh dear, it's all bloody falling apart. I don't know how much, that'll do. I guess I'm just gonna use all the loose pieces. Pieces, leaves. <laughs> yeah, Rugi? This is the sieve that I have, so here's the plan. Empty these into a bowl. Oh, you muck. Well, it's the water I need to get rid of. What a dumbass. Hi, hi, Mr. Rugers. What you up to? So since my problem now is dry scalp, I saw this video the other day of a Korean like hair analysis. That would be really cool to do, just out of interest. Hey, should you be on the counter, mister? You shouldn't be on the counter, should you? Yeah, it's rosemary. Yeah, oh, perfect. Good try though, bud. Okay, we're not gonna play up here though, okay? Okay, can you get down please? Because we shouldn't, no. Can you get down please? Because we shouldn't be up here. Do you want to play with this? Okay, you can hold on to it and take it down with you. Good boy. Now, do I have the money to do something like that? No. Cup of oil. So I thought if you'd be interested in seeing that, 
I think we could create something really cool with LG Beauty and their Dr. Yeah, Dr. Groot shampoo range. So if you'd be so kind, maybe tag them. And honestly, this isn't me like begging. I think that would just be a really cool thing to do. And I would enjoy watching someone else do that. We need to keep this in here for 20 minutes, but I'm gonna do it every five minutes and then change over the hot water because I don't have a pan and a bowl that's gonna, well, I guess I do. I guess that could just sit inside of the boiling water, couldn't it? Oh, and I'm gonna add in some clothes to increase blood flow. I'm not a scientist. Don't really understand what that means, but I think that's more than enough. So yeah, how cool would it be to see a full like hair and scalp analysis of someone who hasn't used shampoo for over a year. Shay, would you find that cool? Give this a quick little stir. Yeah. You got water on you? How'd you do that? Are you a liar liar pants on fire? Ew, you were spitting your water out? Ew. Why is rosemary oil good for your hair? Promotes hair growth, strengthens the blood circulation, which I thought the clothes were for, and has antioxidant properties. Has antimicrobial microbial, and antifungal properties and conditions the hair, Oh. So the goal is to try this for seven days and see what it does. We're only natural in this household, only stir with sticks. Wife's just told me I need to be wary of getting botulism. Start the timer again. Shay, didn't we have a really small sieve? Do I have one? I think I have one in my office. So I have loads of stuff that I bought when I was really into like creative photography, but I don't always remember where everything is and I think it's down there. Yes! Victory dance, <laughs> I just, <laughs> no. Time is off, so that's 20 minutes. We're gonna put it into a container. It needs to be an airtight container. I don't have one, so I'm gonna use these. So I'm just gonna put it in here to store and then put it in the applicator and we'll use it. Okay, got some doTERRA Breathe essential oils. One, two, three. It's amazing how strong essential oils are. Oh yeah, don't play with that, please. You're always interrupting me, Shay. Shut up, Oliver, you old bat. Do you okay, okay, so next one. Um, yes, please. That sounds very delicious. This is one of those, I don't know if it's gonna dribble off the top or off the bottom. I'd normally just commit and go for it. Oh, this is from the X Games when I did a ski season in the French Alps. Tell you what, this is a right faff. May as well just buy it. Okay, we ready? Got a little bit left, but that'll do. Nice job, Oliver. All right, I'm gonna leave that to cool and then we'll put it in the applicator. All right, I'm just gonna clear up quickly. See the USPS pan? Okay, I can't shoot yet. Okay, let's go. I should put socks on, but I can't be asked. I'm too excited. <laughs> All the other bloody mail flew off. I had to start chasing it around on the floor. Good, thanks you. Oh, very fancy. Timu hall number two. There's a bit of tech in here that I'm extremely excited about. I didn't know this was a three pack. This is to get the rest of the toothpaste out of the bottle, the tube. Is it? Because that's what this is. Yeah, I, for some reason I bought two of those. Yeah, so you put the tube in there and then you swirl it around. Surprise, what's this? Oh, this is the scalp nourisher. So recycling, trash. Okay, so we're gonna try that in a second. Wife's hair clips and things. Did I not order it? Idiot. I have folliculitis on my legs, which is where like the hair follicle doesn't get cleaned properly. It's not like a bad thing, it's a very common thing. But I bought something like this to, so that I could use in the shower. This is a smart ring. Dude, when Apple come out with one of these, I'm gonna love it. Damn it, it's too big. Let's download the app. This was $20 and it's meant to track so much. The app is called JU Pro. Bloody hell. You know when you download an app and it asks you for all the permissions? Hey Siri, how tall is five foot 11 in centimeters? 180. 
Step go, 10,000 steps, sure. Right now I can start tracking my running, my walk and my sleep. Let's see if the steps work. Oh, just walking around. Okay, it hasn't counted those steps, but we'll see how it does. Yeah, I can't wait. Like, I think Apple Watches look stupid and they're too big and bulky. But if I could have it as a ring, since I wear a ring anyway, and I don't need the text messaging on my wrist. I just want it to be able to track everything. That would be sweet. Oh. And now I can start tracking it all through the Apple Health app. Okie dokie. Well, I'll start tracking and keep you updated if it's worth the $20. <laughs> Let's go try this, uh, or at least get this hair thing filled up. First of all, girl obsessed. Uh, cold pressed juice from a gas station. Yes. All right, let's get this thing set up. Let's have a quick look at how this works. So I'll try this in the shower tomorrow. <laughs> Stupid. So the little ball bearings push down. Just show my nail. Yeah. Just, I guess, rub that along the roots. So try that tomorrow and give a review and then keep trying it for seven days. Yes, mister. What's up, Ruggie? What you doing, my boy? This is definitely too big. I don't even know if it's tracking properly. Hopefully. Juice. That's what we use for your popsicles. Can you press the red button for me, please? The red one. 